Hey guys, Ian Olschlegel here with Suburban Snowplow in Philadelphia. Wanted to give you a quick product review on five different Western snowplows, including the 2018 Western Whiteout. Let me tell you about each one. This is our oldest plow, the Western Pro. It's a seven foot six wide plow. It weighs 653 pounds. It's an Ultra Mount II. And this one in the picture is 27 inches high. However, the current models that they release are 29 inch mold boards. The next plow up is a Western Pro Plus model shown as a seven foot six wide plow with optional wings measuring an additional six inches on either side. It weighs 790 pounds and has a 31 inch mold board. The next plow up is the Western Prodigy. It's the simplest winged plow on the market weighing it at 880 pounds. In scoop mode, it's eight foot seven wide, and when manually pinned straight, it's nine foot eight. The fourth plow, the Western Whiteout, is by far one of my most favorite plows. It's an eight to 10 foot expandable plow with a 29 inch mold board. It weighs 940 pounds, This year, Western released a newer version of the Western Whiteout. It has a 31 inch mold board in comparison to the older model having a 29 inch mold board. And it comes in two sizes. This one's an 8 to 10 foot expandable plow, but they've also designed one that's better suited for dually trucks, measuring 8.5 to 11 foot wide. On the older model, you'll notice a two bulb design, whereas on the newer model, you'll notice that there's a different shape and it's a three bulb design. On the older model to your right, it's still a 29 inch mold board, but I want you to notice down here the rubber winged edges. On the newer model, it's a 31 inch mold board and Western has added a curb guard here and a steel edge. On the new wide out, they've added some steel here which stiffens the backbone of the mold board. They've also added a piece of steel here to keep from any bending. This older model here weighs 940 pounds, and the same width plow in the newer model is 1,020 pounds. These are things that you should take into consideration when you're buying your truck and what the front axle rating is.
So for those of you with many, many plows in your yard, build an attachment like this where you take the receivers from Western and you weld them to a skid steer plate. Make sure the plate is at least half inch steel, but use this to move your plows around from location to location within your yard. I'm just arriving back here at Perky Omen Performance in Green Lane, Pennsylvania. I wanted to first thank Wayne from Perky Omen Performance and John at Western for giving us the opportunity to showcase this plow. We also took some pictures of it for an upcoming magazine feature. I want to also say that we don't sell plows. I don't have any skin in the game. I'm not being paid for this video, but I do want to give individuals buying trucks and buying plows information that would lead them to buy something that would be successful for their business. Our business has been in for 45 years, and we've used Western for nearly half of that. We've logged thousands of hours on the wideout, and I would tell you that by far that's the best Palau to buy. Feel free to give me a call or subscribe to this YouTube link.